A longtime friend of Michael Jackson made a whole lot of claims about MJ, although I personally question his motives. His claims are still pretty interesting nonetheless. As most of us know, Debbie Rowe and MJ have a colorful history together. They met at Michael's dermatologist office where Debbie was a nurse. Debbie then became MJ's second wife and gave birth of two of his three kids, Paris and Prince. In an interview with Martin Bashir, MJ later revealed that he was single parenting their kids because Debbie gave the kids to him as a gift. Well, years after MJ's death, his supposed friend Mark Lester now claims he is actually the father of Paris Jackson. Dudek admitted he was once a wild parting drug addict, but that he is now clean and sober with some details to spill about Paris DNA a lot. I was just helping out a friend. I think he had a problem with actually doing the physical act of sex and a very low sperm count as well said Lester. The singer allegedly wanted him to make a sperm deposit at a Harley Street cleaning. Michael said it would all be completely confidential and I knew he was asking others in his inner circle actors. Macaulay Culkin, Marlon Brando and Jack Nicholson. Uri Geller, people from Harvard with doctorates all sorts. My kids weren't that Enamored, they thought it a bitty city that's a pen left their life, but they were fine now. At the time of his interview, Mark Lester said he hadn't seen any of MJ's kid since his 2009 funeral and that neither Paris nor her siblings have called him since when asked if he wanted contact with Paris now, Lester said, I can't be bothered. I've got four kids of my own and I'm about to take an on another two children of his new wife. That's my family, he says. Mark Lester, which is no ill will toward Paris, but has harsh words about her mama, Debbie Rowe. First, he dogged her appearance. At first, Lester assumed Jackson wanted him to have sex with his first wife, Roe, who he rather ungallantly describes as the most horrendous looking creatures. Then he talked about her once blocking him from contacting Paris. I did try and get through to her Paris then and her mother told me to F off says Lester but I wish her Paris well. She's bright and great looking kid so if she is my daughter it's nothing to be ashamed of. I don't think Michael worried about color. He just wanted to the best of the best. He wanted to breed superhumans though I don't know why he picked Debbie Rowe that would have negated the whole thing Lester said he and Michael were so close they christened each other's children so when asked by DM why he has now made these claims public about a friend he was supposedly close to Lester said I had to Ori Geller was going to like the story and link my name to it so I decided to put it out there myself. Listen, I don't know if this dude is telling the truth or not. His accusation seems detailed but his timing and motive seems suspect. He waited until after Michael Jackson passing to make such a claim about the men's scandal so the Lister says he doesn't care to be in Paris life which he clearly seems unbothered by. He still did an interview with a major online media source to get the